All right, here we go. Dear Warner Brothers, you have a chance. You have an opportunity. You have an entire universe at your disposal. And you've set it up so that you're going to have this fantastic run until 20, 2020. That's the one we're looking for. You need to do it. You need to do it right. You need to not have the mistakes of the past. We need to not have another Superman Returns. We need to not have another Batman and Robin. And you need to stick at least a little bit kind of to your source material. I know you guys have already kind of changed that. That's cool. You've been doing a wonderful job with it. Making it dark, making it gritty, that's fine. What you need to realize is Marvel has such a leg up. Even if they came out with their next two movies and they were not as good as everything they've done so far, they still have a leg up on you guys. But you have a chance now. Marvel has to fight to get back their titles. Sony and Fox, they own Spider-Man, they own X-Men. That's going to be tough for Marvel Studios. You own the entirety of the DC Universe. You can do whatever you want at this point. But you need to do it right. You need to do it well. You need to have the dark, you need to have the grit, but you also need to have just a little bit of relatability, which I know you tried to do with Man of Steel, with the having the whole two fathers that fight between two worlds, which I enjoyed. I liked everything with John Kent and the, the farm. You did a really wonderful job with that. But that doesn't change the fact that in the past, you guys have added too much, I'd say, well, you went both directions. Superman Returns, you made it way too emotional, and it was awful. And now you've recast Superman as the Atom on Arrow, which, whatever. Or you've got the Batman and Robin where you basically made everybody into toys that have skis inside their boots. So if you can find a healthy balance, I'm really excited for what you guys have planned. I love the actors you have cast. The Rock as Black Adam is a fantastic move in my opinion. You just better match up with a good Shazam. Jason Moa as Aquaman, even though he still says he's not going to be Aquaman. Another fantastic move despite the fact that Aquaman is a short blonde guy, but you've got a gigantic Hawaiian Islander dude, and he's going to be awesome at it, and I love you for that. Um, and you've got a good Wonder Woman, so keep it up. Don't let everything fall through. I promise you guys are going to be okay. That's for me. <laughs>